Hey guys, it's Hogan here, and today I've got a really cool video for you guys, so make sure to stick to the very end. So basically I'm going to show you how you can actually import AliExpress products onto your WordPress website for free so you can start dropshipping today. So basically you can click the link down below and that's going to take you to Dropship Me. Now Dropship Me is a standalone plugin created by the Ali Dropship people as well. Okay, so they've created a plugin and what you can basically do is you can install it onto your uh, WordPress and WooCommerce website and you can import AliExpress products. But what's different about this plugin is they've actually handpicked uh, 50,000 of the top selling dropshipping products for you and then you can just one click and import it onto your website. Okay, you can also import the reviews as well. So what it doesn't do is it doesn't actually do the semi-automated um, fulfillment process. Okay, so you can't actually uh, one click it and then it doesn't actually take you to the AliExpress website to make that order. You have to do that manually. But you know what's good about this plugin is you know they've already handpicked the products, they've edited the titles, they've edited the images, and they've also checked the suppliers as well. So you're saving a lot of time and it's free. So basically, you know, for people who don't who are not really sure whether or not you know you, you actually want to pay $89 for the Ali Dropship plugin, which is the complete solution, then you can use this plugin to import the products. Because otherwise you have to import it, you know, manually by screenshotting the images and then you know um, adding in the variations and all that stuff yourself this saves you a lot of time. So you can get started for free and see how it goes first. Um, you know, anyways, uh, we're gonna get started and I'm gonna show you exactly how to use it. So you wanna click the link down below and that's gonna take you to this website here. Okay, you can watch the product video as well and you can have a look at the page, but click on start now, it's free. And what you need to do here, you need, you need to enter in your email and click on get my plugin now. So that's gonna um, get your plugin sent to your email address, all right? So your email should look something like this. Thank you for choosing uh, Dropship Me. And you wanna download that plugin onto your computer, okay? Because we're gonna install that onto our WordPress website, all right? And here is your API key, so you must activate it. So we're gonna copy that to our clipboard. And then we wanna go to the WordPress website. Okay, so here I'm in my WordPress website and you wanna make sure you have WooCommerce installed, which is the e-commerce plugin that adds the e-commerce functionality to your WordPress website. And then you wanna to go to plugins. And then you wanna click on add new. And you want to upload the plugin, choose file. And you wanna look for the dropship-me.zip. So it has to be the .zip, okay? If it's in a folder, you might need to right click and compress it back into the zip file before you open and import it, okay? And then click on install now. And then what you wanna do is you wanna activate it. So I've already installed and activated it, okay? Then you should get a dropship me here. And then you wanna click on activation. And then you wanna click on API key. And you wanna make sure you paste in your API key here and click on activate, okay? so. Each API key is um, for just one domain, all right? So you wanna activate that. And then basically what you wanna do is you wanna click on import products, okay? So this is where you actually browse and import the products directly onto your website, okay? That's pretty cool. <laughs> so let's go to search, okay? So let's just, for example, you can search by category as well. So I'm gonna try and search for maybe teapot. Okay, so as you can see here, they have the results here. Um, they have, I think, over 51,000 products and they're also adding more products as well. So here are all the ones here. Okay, so when you're actually um, selecting a product, you do wanna get a product which has a lot of orders and also some reviews as well. So let's just say we want this lovely glass teapot and I'm gonna click on view details to see if there's any reviews. Um, let's click on reviews. Okay. Okay, that's pretty good. But I think some of them are four stars. So let's just go back and let's have a look at other ones here. Heat resistant glass teapot. Let's just click on view details. 
So anything above 4.5 is generally pretty good. Click on reviews first. Okay, product which as described. Very nice. Okay, so that's pretty good. All right, so let's just say we want to import this product here, this teapot. Okay, you'll just click on import and that's going to take a few minutes because that's going to import the images and it's going to import the description and all the variations as well. Okay, so you got to be patient and I think it should have a sort of progress bar up here, the blue line there, and I'm just going to wait for that, all right? Okay, so once that is imported, then it should come up with a notification up here and it should say imported here, right? So once that is imported, we actually need to go to the product section. Okay, so click on products. And we need to actually approve that. So we can actually see that it says draft here. Okay, so that's not published onto our store yet. So you want to click on edit and you want to manually check it as well. So you want to, you know, add some more to that description. You might add a video or you might add some other stuff. Okay, so you want to scroll down and here is the uh, description. Okay, I think that's the long description. Here is a short description, which you can add more to the product, which I recommend. And as you can see, this is a variable product and they've actually imported everything that you need as well. So this is a variable product. You know, they have the SKU, also the stock quantity, and you know, they've added all the things that, you know, is needed as well. Okay, so if you click on variations, here they've added all the variations as well along with the images and also the price and yeah basically everything that you need so i think it's really cool um what's important is you want to click on supplier information and here it's actually going to take you to the supplier um product as well so once a customer actually places an order you'll have to go to the supplier's uh, product url and place that order manually with the customer's um shipping details and stuff like that okay with the ali dropship plugin um, this plugin actually uh, semi-automates the process. So you can actually click one button and that will actually direct you to the AliExpress website and it will it will automatically sort of um, take the customer shipping information and paste it into the AliExpress website. And then all you need to do is pay, okay? So let's go back here. And I think, you know, everything's all good. You can add in your categories and product tags. So this one is a teapot, so let's just add a teapot. And then we can click on publish, all right? So what's really cool about this plugin is you can actually add um, the reviews as well. So you probably wanna add some social proof um, to show that people, you know, people are actually buying this, this teapot, right? You don't wanna just, you know, import it without reviews and, you know, adding more to the, to the description as well, okay? So let's go to the Dropship Me plugin and click on import reviews. And here you can apply the filters for the reviews you wanna import. So you can do only five stars or four stars and higher, up to 20 reviews. And we wanna send reviews to draft because you sort of wanna look through the reviews as well. And then you want to import reviews with images only, okay. and then click on import. Okay, so that's gonna take a few seconds as well. Okay, the progress should show 100% and it should say the reviews have been imported successfully. So once you've done that, then click on comments and you wanna approve the comments basically. Okay, so here is the heat resistant glass teapot. Okay, very nice. Okay, so as you can see, this one here is in, I think, I think it's in Russian. I'm not sure. Uh, so you need to edit it um, before you approve it. Okay, so let's say that one's okay. Let's just approve that one and you can approve this one here. So these are some other ones here. Let's just approve that. Um, this one is for the phone case. Okay, so once you've done that, then we can go back to visit our site. Okay, so this is the e-commerce website which I recently just um, uh, did an updated tutorial for. So if you're looking for an e-commerce tutorial or anything like that, then you can uh, follow this tutorial. I I'll put the link down below. Um, so here is the actual teapot. Okay, so I think it looks pretty good. So let's just click into that. 
and then they've got the images you can choose the option here let's just say we choose the 1000 mil okay so you've got the price which has been set in for you and the customers can add that to cart okay they've imported the images and with the reviews as well okay so i think that's really good for a free plugin okay so if we go back here to our dashboard um, what you notice is that you'll have a limit of i think 50 products which you can actually import um, but if you want to get more products you can click on get more products and i think you have to pay i think 29 dollars for up to 100 products and these are products which have been manually picked so they've edited the titles and all the um, descriptions and all the pictures and everything like that okay so you can order now that really depends on you um, if you want to go with this option or if you want to go with the Ali dropship plugin which is a um, plugin which helps you sort of manually import it yourself you can choose your own products and then you can use the semi-automated uh, ordering process to to basically help you order the products for your customers okay so hopefully um, you found some value in this video if you have make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe thank you guys and see you guys in the next video